The eraser can not only remove strokes, but it can even remove things like the last stroke that you finished drawing, and also can be used to create artwork. So what I'm going to do with this layer selected is I'm going to go to my paint tools and I'm going to once again double click on the Everest layer to put her in her own layer and I'm going to grab the brush first and I'm going to find a good frame to work on. Let me go ahead and just scrub a little bit. You'll notice by the way I can scrub here or down here in the timeline and I'm going to take about let's see 60% opacity or so. I'm going to just paint this blue color right around her eyes like so and on the muzzle. Now what we can do is grab the eraser tool and you'll notice by the way that we have if you look at the entire paint panel we have erase here that it's ghosted out because we don't have the tool selected. So I'll click on the eraser and now the eraser wakes up and I have it already selected and I can just start to erase the last stroke. Now as I mentioned before the eraser can be used as an art tool as well. So if I wanted to create stripes on her, I can simply increase the size of the brush. Let me go ahead and increase the diameter. I can go ahead and just erase some of the things I've already put in place. A little easier sometimes to go this way as opposed to drawing this kind of shape. So of course it doesn't look great, but I'm, you get the idea. You can create stripes and you can put dots on something and you can use this as a drawing tool. But there are a couple of different functions for the eraser as you can see here we have layer source and paint so as you can see here I'm erasing both the paint and the layer itself which I don't want to do but as you can see that's what it does we also have the ability to erase paint only and you'll see that the cat is not being affected by this eraser and in reality she probably eat the eraser and we also have last stroke only which is very interesting let me go ahead and change the color of the brush to something like a greenish color and I'm going to paint three strokes one two three now with the eraser set to last stroke only look what happens when I try to erase the top one nothing how about the second one nothing but the last stroke was this guy so it's pretty cool this is really handy when you want to do things like stripes or anything that you only want to affect the last one. And this gives you the freedom to not mess up anything else. Another use for it, let me go ahead and delete these strokes here, is if I take my brush and I draw a wide area like so, and I draw another area that's next to that one, and I only want to play around up here. So I can grab my eraser and I have the last stroke only, and you notice that I can kind of whittle into that part and not really bother anything down here. So that is a look at the eraser. Once again it can erase in several different ways or you can use it to create artwork as well.